Long ass titles. I have been trying to get better at basketball by playing baseball games. So many memories of friends playing both sports makes me wonder why I didn't do more, play more, go out more, get in physical shape. Maybe I could be having better days, healthier days, always maintaining my breath, instead of suffering after a mile stretch, run across the street, where all the athletes gather up and meet to discuss their lives, and how this work gave them a reason why to exist while leaving a legacy behind. Sure, I ponder quite a lot, but there's no need to complain, no need to feel bad about my past. After all, I have accomplished more than I thought, over 40 books to my name, over 600 interviews too, and I got more lined up for many years to come. No need to feel bad, kid. You've done quite a lot. Just feel bad whenever you've not, and you've wasted time, and you wasted life, on stuff that don't bring you joy or laughter, on stuff that don't bring you love or laughter. I miss my friends and I just want us to party once more. Pero las cosas cambian and distance makes it difficult and works makes it difficult and parenthood makes it difficult. But at least we got the web and our phones to keep us connected. Party till you puke or at least to the point where you make a memory. Eso me digo todos los días a ver si traigo un poco de cambio a la rutina. Me hace falta con cojones. I just wish we'd spend more time together before that unexpected goodbye. No sabes cuánta falta, tío, pero la vida te llevó así como si nada. Some people might say that I should move on, pero siempre te llevo. I mean, ¿quién se olvidaría de esa risa? You might see me partying, but deep down inside I'm hurting for you. Deseo verte una vez más, decirte que te amo con más frecuencia, tirarnos par de stories y unos chistes más. Me hace falta con cojones, tío. Por lo menos estas letras ayudan un poco. At first I only wanted one, pero el tiempo me ha hecho considerar three or five. And I don't know why, pero I guess it's because I feel lonely and I want more family around me, especially cuando llegue el día de mi departure. Un largo viaje across la isla, the states y otros países no vendría mal. After all, the world seems hopeless. Why not enjoy lo que nos queda? La juventud se me fue rápido and I'm still catching up con todo. Con todo, todo, todo. Todos los viajes no tomados, todo el arte no expresado, todos los momentos no creados, y la cosa se pone difícil con cada día que pasa. La cosa entre nosotros está difícil y no tengo idea de qué puñeta vamos a hacer. Se me pongo a pensar con cojones buscándole cinco patas al gato y tratando de cuadrarle rompecabezas, pero no encuentro nada, y de verdad que no veo soluciones bellas a todo esto. I know you're struggling, but a little struggle can help you grow and learn. So take the challenge and think a few interesting creative ways to get out of this problem. It sucks, I know, but think of it as growing up a level or transforming into something new, like the first time we saw a Super Saiyan. This challenge won't beat me. Confia, I found a cheat code. And it might help you too. A little bit of work every day will do wonders. And before you know it, you'll have a new project done. And a new one on the back of your mind. Just wanting to be given life. A little bit of time on the web can be fun and inspire until it isn't. Yes, yes, but we fail to recognize this on time and already we are addicted and depressed and it becomes difficult to detach from the machine. Q 
Keep living to the fullest, kid. Confia. You have a better life than mine. A lot of saying no and a lot of doing what others want will hold you back from achieving anything you want in life. 